Hey everyone, Alex here again with another video. Today, doing something a little bit different. I'm doing a regular soap and a water wash in a bucket. I know, it's not rinseless. It's the next best thing. We have a super mild day here in the winter. So I better take advantage of it. So for the holiday season, was generously gifted some GFX from my good friends over at Koshemi and TOC Supplies. Now, if you haven't tried the super limited edition, so I don't blame you if you haven't, Christmas in a bottle, we got apple, we got cinnamon, we got all kinds of delicious goodness. It smells like Christmas, so I'm gonna be throwing that in. Kind of a new favorite MJJC foam cannon here. Uh, a couple of videos ago, showcased this sucker. Awesome foam, so we're gonna try out the GFX in there. And just a uh, the wash pad from the Ray Company, the Cyclone wash pad. Some people prefer the mitt. I like the pad, personally, without that cuff. But I digress, that's just me, and we're gonna do one bucket. Alex, one bucket, what are you talking about? Two bucket wash method. No, it's fine. Don't be like everybody else. One bucket's just totally fine. Have a grit guard in there, wash it off. Be smart with it. Go back to the bucket a little bit more frequently. You don't need 17 pads. You don't need 17 buckets. We're gonna make it work. So stay tuned, we're gonna foam the car give it a rinse, wash it, and you're gonna ride along for the entire thing, so stay tuned. Okay, so we got the GFX, and you'll notice a little unique little cap on here. This is the KCX dispensing cap. So this thing, you squeeze it, and it will fill it up to 20 milliliters at the top. So I got 900 mils of water, and with this, looking at the instructions, it's looking at a 50 milliliters into 10 liters of water. So that's for the bucket. Now with this, just judging by Past experience, I like to have fun with it. So I'm gonna go about two ounces in this, which is roughly 60 milliliters, so about three of these. So I'm not gonna bore you filling this up, but we're gonna quickly fast forward and fill this up. That's why I'm gonna do more. Now for my Canadian friends out there, that is a nice golden maple syrup color, so right up our alley. So this vehicle behind me, I'm gonna pre-rinse it first. I'm not gonna pre-foam. Rinse, then we're gonna foam, then we're gonna bucket wash, so stay tuned. So it's a little breezy out here, so we're gonna do this as quickly as we can. The nice thing about this foam cannon is that weighted ball actually mixes the soap. Super cool. Turn it all the way to the right on the top, and then we'll mess with the fan pattern a little bit later. So like I said, it's a bit windy, so we're gonna foam the car, and I'll try not to get so much on me. We'll get more on the car, so let's give it a go. Oh, does it ever smell like Christmas. So I have about 20 mils of the GFX in the bucket and the pad. And a hot tip, take what's left in your foam cannon and dump it right in there. And then we're gonna suds it up. And 
And then like any wash, we're gonna go top to bottom. This is a super slick soap. Really enjoy it, and I mean, the smell of Christmas is wicked. If you can get your hands on a bottle, definitely do so. All right, so that was a quick demo wash with the Koshemi GFX Christmas Edition Shampoo. Like I've said a couple times, if you can get your hands on that bottle, do so. If not, so sorry, just take my word for it that it smells like a delicious Christmas day. So thanks for tuning in. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse the car now and then dry it off and uh, stay tuned for the next video. Good morning.